VLSI and Embedded are the most demanding subdomains of core electronics branch in terms of job opportunities. And I am available with comparison between Embedded and VLSI. Usually I receive comments from aspirants whether to go for Embedded or VLSI. But they don't mention the details. And guys, I can't just say that VLSI is better or Embedded is better. That's why I have decided to compare them across various factors. And yes, this comparison will help you for sure to conclude. We will see most important factors and clear cut winner based on that particular factor. So let me start with some intro about both fields. In simple words, everything inside the chip or everything needed to eventually create a chip is VLSI. On the other hand, Embedded system involve use of specific purpose chips along with peripherals and a real-time operating system to create end products like smartphones, camera, smart washing machines and smart watches and many more. So basically these embedded systems utilize chips created by VLSI engineers to perform specific functions within those devices. Complexity, salary, future scope, stability and growth are the major factors to judge any domain. VLSI and Embedded both are great electronics subdomains and the products are literally used by every single person on this earth. But VLSI jobs are usually more complex as they deals with sophisticated chip design process. Imagine a chip with billions of transistor having area less than a parley biscuit. So you can imagine the complexity. Embedded system too requires deep understanding but it deals with integration of chips and other required peripherals RTOs to make an end product. Embedded is hard but on neck to neck comparison VLSI is is clearly far more complex. Just read about embedded and VLSI and self evaluate whether you can handle that much complexity or not. If you can handle that much complexity then VLSI would be comparatively better option for you. Why I am saying this? Well the reason is other factors. Salary, stability, future scope and growth. Complexity is more in VLSI and the result is higher salary. Please remember the comparison should be honest and if academic background years of experience remain similar then probably in most of the cases VLSI engineers would be having greater salary. Since VLSI is complex so opportunities would be there but you need to be skilled enough to get into those jobs and since it's complex job so a product based company would always try to retain the talent and would also provide a proper growth. Hence VLSI is clear winner because mostly VLSI would outperform embedded role in terms of scope, salary, stability and growth. If you can handle the complexity then VLSI would be a better career choice else go for embedded. All this discussion doesn't mean embedded don't have complexity, salary, stability or growth. It was all about when embedded is compared with VLSI. Otherwise embedded too have a good score on all these factors. Remember if you are genuinely interested in embedded in that case as well you should choose embedded only. These factors matter only when you are confused between VLSI or embedded and you have interest in both. So that completes the answer for VLSI versus embedded.